Hello everyone, as you may all know, I'm currently in the process of moving from Virginia to Indiana, and because of that I'm not going to be on that much, if any, by like pretty much for a week-ish. Um, that being said, there are some things I want to announce to you all that will happen with the community, with the guild, and everything else. First of all, we will be having a weekly video just like this, as well as a weekly discussion in which I will post uh, officially on the Discord, and we will have a huge discussion, and we will explain everything that's gone or that happened last week and what's going to happen next week. On top of that, before that actually happens, we will also have a discussion with all the generals, four stars, and also the guildmaster, aka myself, where we discuss the same things as well as what everyone's done, contributed, etc., etc. And this will be a weekly thing. On top of that, we will be doing some we will be adding more awards. These awards will be stuff like having our signature on the Ashes forum, uh, making posts on our official post on the Ashes forum. Other game pack leader is what it's called. And what that would be is if you create an event, even an unofficial event that you post on the forums and get at least five people to be active in it, you will get a leadership badge for that and everyone else that participates will get a participation badge. On top of that, you will we'll also add Ashes Pack Leader, which is the same thing but strictly for Ashes of Creation. Obviously that won't happen for a while. Um, let's see, I'm reading from a list here and this is going to be unedited, so don't mind the pause, the stutterings, and all the ums. I apologize in advance. Event planning must have five people, must have one leader, must be posted on the forums, either as an official event or an unofficial event. There's a section for that as well. And the event must also last at least an hour. Another thing we're going to do as of next week is we are going to create official guild games until Ashes comes out. We will find what everyone's playing and we'll pretty much create like four or five official games that we will have events in and everything else, as well as the ability to create more official games. The requirements for that will also be five people minimum. You have to have five guild members playing that game, and they will have to be members of Ashes of Creation Guild and not just guests. So that being said, let's say we don't have World of Warcraft as an official guild game, but if there's five people that do play it and they want to form an Ashes or Knights of Ember guild then y'all can do that let me know and as long as there's at least five people with one leader then we will create that as an official game and anyone else playing world of warcraft they can hop on and play as well etc etc weekly updates i already talked about let's see anything i missed live discussions with everyone push a talk will be required uh i will have full priority as well as all the generals and and up we will record it and upload it just like this. It'll be this exact unedited session so everyone can go and they can see everything, listen to everything, understand what's happening, what's going on, et cetera, et cetera. If we have a video editor that wants to help out, you can do that, maybe even get official or you know, uh, a rank or something along those lines for helping out, maybe even awards or something. Anyway, um, we the general discussions we will do as well another thing we're gonna have uh starting next week if not the week after starting off the new week we will have weekly events and these will be various different things and they're pretty much there to give night points to people there's not a lot of ways to get night points and for those of you that don't know night points will be used to buy ashes of creation related content if we have a legendary sword that let's say I got and I'm not going to use, I'm going to upload that to the shop. And with that, you can actually spend night points to obtain that without actually spending anything in Ashes of Creation. Think of it as a secondary uh, currency strictly for participating and doing certain things around the uh, guild. 
So, with that in mind, we will hold weekly events that will give night points to obtain stuff like that. These events will range from posting on the forums where you get like one entry for every post or three entries for every topic you make. It'll be stuff like, hey, everyone donate to Albion or donate on Ashes of Creation for every thousand gold you donate one raffle ticket or it'll be something like hey whoever is the most active this week wins whatever the reward is and stuff like that so it's it's just there to encourage people to do stuff participate in the guild play games with each other we might have runescape events where if you're the best in that or something you have the highest amount of xp gain for that week you you gain or you can win the weekly event and just you know fun stuff like that it, it's there to give uh bring f fresh you know a breath of fresh air to the activities that we have and stuff like that and on top of that we have the the basic ranks so, if you don't know about the rank structure, you have the PvP, PvE, Gatherer, Crafter, and Basic. We are actually going to open up the basic ranking structure to those that actually want to progress in the basic tier before Ashes comes out. This will be the only way to become a dedicated private specialist, corporal, sergeant, or general in the ranking system before Ashes of Creation comes out. Now, keep in mind, if you become a general in Basic, and when Ashes comes out, you want to switch over to PvP, you will lose a lot of your ranks, if not all of your ranks, all the way back down to Dedicated. So keep that in mind. This is for people that want to be a general leader in the guild without actually participating hands-on and directly with a single thing. A basic general will have basic power over the the guild at in general they will be able to be like hey y'all can and cannot do this you know certain things on the forums on whatever need be versus a pvp general will be directly in charge of pvp events they will be like all right we only do this i i can only be in charge of pvp type stuff i can participate in others i can lead others just like any other rank however i am only in charge of the pvp individuals so keep that in mind but if you do want to be a basic or get promoted in the basic rankings uh let me know on top of that you pretty much have to be a specialist beforehand so keep that in mind actually i lied you don't have to be a specialist i don't know what i'm talking about you you're gonna have to be pretty much a, a member first and then start getting promoted to the dedicated private and specialist in the basic. Those of y'all who have already advanced from dedicated up, keep in mind this is the basic role, and you will lose this if you go into any other subcategory. So just wanted to let y'all know about that and just inform you that you can rank higher than specialist as of now in the basic ranking. So, to those of y'all that want a leadership role, go ahead, continue to strive for it. Um, make sure to check out the ranking structure on the forums that shows exactly how to progress in the ranks. Um, yeah, anyway, y'all have a great rest of the week. Sorry I'm going to be gone, and just feel free to still keep me posted on anything, and have a good one.